What's not the love? They're perfect. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you know, the, the, the custom, it's as good of a guitar as any made anywhere on earth by anybody. And they're all perfect. Like, uh, you know, I have a lot of friends who work with other companies and uh, they like, they'll get some custom made guitar and they spend months trying to make it sound good. <laughs> I'm like, why? You know, like I could literally, like during all the Slayer tours, Warren could have handed me any guitar off the rack. And, you know, it, to me, I picked them based on which finish I wanted to use for whatever songs, but, you know, if I was colorblind and they had no graphics and so he could hand me any of them and it would not have made a difference. The consistency is so killer. And the LTDs, I use them all the time. I use them all the time. I use them in Slayer. I use them in Exodus. All the time, all the time. I mean, if you looked at um, the Exodus COVID 2020 tour in Europe, you know, which we um, just did, you know, I had that the new custom woodcut, you know, which is like mm -hmm. one of the sickest guitars ever, and it weighs a ton. And I took two LTDs, you know. I mean, you know as well as anybody, I have, I have an arsenal of just fine customs, and I took mm -hmm. two LTDs over there, you know, because but I love them, and I use the white one all the time in the set. And I played the white one, and I'd go back and forth to the black one, but I played the white one most of the whole show. Nice. Sounds killer. It's light look great you know what else could you want you know i used to have a white and red guitar and i thought it looked great you know and it's you know some people might have said well I, you know when you're telling them about it it's like gonna look kind of candy cane ish but i like candy canes so <laughs> i mean it looks amazing it looks great the the white just pops with the red border you know with the you know the triple fly binding and and it's awesome. And I'm a, you know, I was born an Oklahoma Sooners fan. And so you know, the colors are, you know, the red and white of the, the Boomer Sooners. It came from you guys. You had, um, when I went down to the ESP offices uh, of one time in the early stages of this, you had uh, the liquid metal silver FXR, I believe. And I was like, that's amazing. I love that finish. Could we do that in a color, you know, and, uh, and it just came out perfect. I mean, it. I remember that first year when it debuted at NAMM, people were like, whoa, that is like, a, I want a show car that finish. You know, it's like that beautiful. Anybody, anybody. I mean, we have three models, you know, and the starter model is a very cool guitar too. If you're a kid while looking for something that has great playability and, and is affordable and has great components that's the way to start then you get to the ltd the next one and it's perfect even for me and then you know if you you know got an inheritance you know you go get the other one <laughs> it's amazing how you know good that thing is it's amazing it's just perfection you know but i mean i'd recommend them to anybody because they're the best simple i could play anything i wanted i mean i'm not bragging by that but you know like you know within reason and i have a lot of guitars you know and i've got some really cool shit you know i'm but they're just perfect and they're interchangeable in their perfect consistency you know it's like like i said you know um if someone was packing the gear up for me and loading guitars to go to europe and they took all the wrong ones but they're the right ones but I, I told them to bring like purple rain and this and that and they brought the gold top and that i wouldn't care they're all badass you know like i'm i'm lucky and blessed to play them every night you know?